off on me. I already burned out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, how are you? How are you? Welcome back. Hey, this is Sam. And uh, Atlanta, as we come into the West Coast swing, and uh, you know what uh, what has gone well? What are you looking forward to? What are you looking forward to as you come to the Auto Club Speedway? Well, uh, so far this season, first off, thanks for for having me. It's uh, I had a lot of fun going through the museum, but uh, this is uh, this is cool. I'm glad you guys put this together. Uh, usually, we, we we go do these uh, appearances to help promote the races coming up, and you don't really know what you're getting yourself into. <laughs> And uh, honestly, I never really do. But uh, uh, a Ford Fairlane picks me up at the airport. Oh, this is going to be a good day. So, <laughs> so this has been a lot of fun to check everything out. But uh, to answer your question, um, you know, this season has been, uh, you know, it's been long so far. It's been two weeks. And um, we've had uh, eventful races, I guess is, is what we should say. Um, we've had good recoveries. Um, you know, we've had some loose wheel issues. Um, in both races, and, and particularly in Daytona, um, in both the the duel and the uh, and the 500, and we were able to recover for to a sixth place finish. Um, and the same thing last week, <laughs> had uh, uh, for different reasons, but had uh, the same problem um, with loose wheels and making extra pit stops, and was able to recover to a sixth place finish. So um, we've had fast cars. That's always something that uh, that's the hardest thing to fix if you don't have that. It's, that's not easy to, to overcome. It takes a long time to catch up. So I think our cars are fast. Our teammate won last week um, with Brad. So I think that shows that our, our cars have speed. I think this week in Vegas is going to show even more kind of where everyone stacks up. Um, and then uh, I think with this West Coast Swing, I enjoy it. It's a lot of fun. There's a lot of really good racetracks. But, uh, you know, Auburn Club Speedway in particular, I think is every driver's favorite track. Um, I think we all love it. And I'm not just saying that because I'm here. Um, it makes it easier to say that, obviously. But um, it's been such a fun racetrack the last few years. Um, as the asphalt's kind of wore in to where it needs to be, the, the tires fall off, you slip and slide. And I was re-watching the race out here in the five and a half hour plane ride. And, uh, um, you know, I was, was re-watching it and you watch these restarts and it's just, it's crazy how many different lanes there is and then the long runs, there's cars up top and then they, they can make speed and cars on the bottom, on the apron, they can make speed. Uh, and that makes it a lot of fun as a race car driver to get away from other cars and be able to get air on them. You know, we talk about, you know, having clean air, dirty air a lot. Um, you know, when you go to a racetrack that's really wide and we're going over 200 miles an hour, uh, trying to get some air on the car to make it handle is important. So when you have a track that's wide, like, uh, Auto Club is uh, you can go you can go anywhere and and make sure you make your car fast and, and be able to put on that good racing and uh, and then obviously when you're going that fast the draft becomes in the, a big play so um, it's a fun race for the race car drivers and and uh, and it's fun just to come out here to the West Coast you know NASCAR doesn't uh, come out here as much as as I like us to um, you know and and we want to put on the best race we can when we're here and we got some great race tracks for that reason and uh, so looking forward to it in a few weeks. Okay, we got an automatic here, huh? Is it a new in neutral? It's in park. Okay. Okay, cool. Now, what year is this one? This is a this is a 1957 Ford Fairlane Skyliner. Okay, 57 Ford. Fa I had a 57 Chevy Bel Air. A little different. Let's wait for this truck to go. Okay, we're gonna take our take some of the folks watching here uh, for a ride as well. Okay, here we go. Love. Uh oh, it's stalled. That was <laughs> fun. <laughs> there we go. Baby. Ah, uh, this is cool. 
can't think of a better way to be promoting the Auto Club 400 than driving around in some old cars with Joey Logano and you guys. Right. So I don't think the only difference between this and, and you know, racing around Auto Club Speedway is I don't think they have their arm out the window and their hand up on the wheel like this, but I'm throwing the vibe out right now, so I'm trying to, you know, look cool, which is pretty hard to do. Um, <laughs> We're just going to do a trip around the block. We're not going to go far. So last thing I needed was to put a dent in this thing. But uh, I'm actually just excited. They let me get behind the wheel of these things. Someone told them I might know how to drive a little bit. But I think it's just driving from point A to point B. Here we go. Steering input's a little slow. Ride's nice, though. Ride's real nice. This is, this is Southern California right here. Oh, yes, yes, sir. This is Southern California. You got the top down, sun's out. I think we should just keep going straight and go to the beach. <laughs> People are honking at us. Goes up, up on the wheel. We got a little pedestrian traffic here coming across the way. Oh yeah. Lunchtime traffic. Hey guys. Alright, here we go. Alright, another successful lap. Brought it back in one piece too. You guys and the car. Alright. Back it up for these guys a little bit here. All right.